right guys, so what's up though? I'm back though today. Got a really, 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 really quick um Doug and Matt video I want to do it really quick. You already know it's gonna be like 10,000 years long anyway. But yeah, um again, the last couple of days I've been trying to fix my voice up a little bit because I've had been noticing as I, you know, um I know you guys finally have noticed like, you know, more you know newer or older or whatever. In my other videos, my music was really loud and it kind of turned on my voice so hopefully my voice will sound good again when i talk to stuff like that specifically for me i have a problem with this where everybody always has not a problem for this but everybody always tells me you know my voice is kind of deep and i can't really tell that the tone of it and stuff like that so yeah um for like older new fans whoever's watching this i don't know you could be new um you cannot know about it but yeah again i'm gonna try to fix it up in the future i think it's like my wording's really fast it might be the tone maybe wording or tone Either way, it doesn't really matter, but yeah. Again, I'll try to fix it in the future. I kind of get it now because I do talk really, really fast. But yeah, of course, though, we did get some pretty good stuff for Global right now. Of course, the day hit number one in the App Store for um, Global. We finally got that. Everybody, their mom's been complaining, like, where are the number one step stores? Where is it? Um, I think last night I did, it was like at 2.34, I think, um, p.m., around 2.30-ish. I did actually fall asleep and I did wake up. And so I was like, oh yeah, I can do a video. And I was like, I'm going to probably wait until the morning. Um, right now for me, time's going to get Saturday, um, September 19th, 2020. So, yeah, for me, it's Saturday right now. I'm about upload this Sunday. Again, um, I've been trying to going back and forth uploading videos. So, yeah, um, again, I had a thumbnail. I just literally finished the thumbnail for this video already. So, I'm going to have that. Of course, it's going to be ready to go in the morning. So, I don't have to spend too much time on it, though. But, yeah, of course, Goldman, again, the Goldman JP got the same exact award. I did actually upload the JP video. It's live on the channel. So, again, I'll look at, it'll probably be um, somewhere around here. Um... Probably over here after I'm done with the video. If you do want to skip to the end, you see it should be like right here. The other videos and stuff like that will be right here. The subscribe button will be right here. So, you know, if you want to subscribe, hit that button, whatever. I don't care. Um, because again, I'm not going to be like, oh yeah, you subscribe to me and blah, blah, blah. I'm not that type of person. I'm not that selfish. I'm really not. If you want to sub, go ahead and sub. You don't have to if you don't want to. You can just watch this video just because you feel like it. It doesn't matter. If you're new, old, it doesn't really matter. I don't care. I mean, just, eh, I don't know. People always say that. But yeah, of course. Um, of course, now that you get this stuff, I know Global Day actually hit now um, one in, of course, France and Hong Kong. They usually hit that. I know, like, because I know for every country we do get seven stones. This is a prime example right here I talk about with Cooler. Um, we hit number one, of course, you know, for every country we got stones. So as more countries, stuff like that, get um, hit, like, for example, Luxembourg, Luxembourg or, you know, U.S. or whatever. Um, that's where I live. U.S. But yeah, um, we're going to get more stones. But again, like, like it was last time, every time we hit a country, we got seven more stones. Before it was 60, like the original one right here. Um, up here for global. Um, right here it was originally it was sixty, but then they changed it to um um seventy. Um, it was sixty five, then it was seventy. Um, they did do that, which I kind of did like. Again, the awards were exactly the same. I guess global got a little bit more stones here. That I guess global was like and get people like okay, let's kind of um do the same thing here like we did because I think global got a little bit more stones because you know they kept hitting for every country they get they get seven stone hit they hit. They get seven stones, so that's how it's gonna be structured and stuff like that. So that's how it was um, structured. So yeah, again, look, when we hit more countries, we're gonna probably get more stones. Again, probably still with that exactly the same as JP on um, that one over a couple days ago. Um, right here, again, exact same rewards. Again, the JP is just one big country, so for them, like I think when Kid Goku came out, the in Kid Goku that's currently on the um Dell celebration banner for the tickets or stone version, whatever one, which one you want to call it, same exact banner. Um, I know he um um. He hit number one about a couple more out, couple hours. I know when um Blue Fusions when they first originally came out, I think they hit like I think even before the Barons were live, the game was already number one. So we didn't have to wait that long. I think Global took a couple of times. I did do videos for them. I just didn't upload them yet. I think I have them ready. I just don't have them. I might, I might still upload those videos honestly. For Global hitting number one for um yeah, cause I do want to upload every top ghosting video I can. I can get my hands on and stuff like that. So yeah, um again. Same exact rewards, same thing. I, I'll even post it on the thumbnail because I did do that already. Like, I'm gonna maybe just start posting the rewards, like where I'm mean, stuff like that on the thumbnail so you guys can see, like, how much you get. So, you know, if, you, if you're curious or whatever, I don't know, just trying to change it up and be, you know, creative and unique and different. I know, because I, I don't know, as I go on YouTube, I actually have learned a lot more and more and more about myself. You know, that I didn't really know before. So, yeah, again, love it so much. So, yeah, and I do love doing thumbnails. Like, I love doing them. But, of course, um, again, never really go over the top grossing units and stuff like that. But, again, usually people, they do end up doing pulling fire from the got, um, from the um, top grossing stones. So yeah, um, for me, I, how about yeah? Because um, I used to get all my stones some on the very last day. Unfortunately, I did miss the discounts for this time around because my internet was out last week. Um, so recording was out like technically last week for me, so I couldn't really do anything that much. So that's how it was. That's all I was specifically. So I had to wait and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, again, Vegeta stuff like that really good. Again, I'm glad it's a good worthy rivals unit and of course a good physical unit. I'm so glad I made him physical. Like this celebration for physical, I'm glad they needed the buff like this much. I still didn't really need it because again. 
new Super Vegeta is STR. Again, I'll make a whole big wrap-up video for the Down Celebration, Down Celebration and the fight in the anniversary specifically. Because Thank You Celebration does usually come back. I, I kind of get. I just kind of thought of it right now. The units come back constantly over and over and over again, and there's kind of no point doing a video on it because those kind of things are typical. Like every year is the exact same thing, but uh, upon like the anniversaries are completely different. And Down Celebration, you know, they're kind of like you know 1.5 anniversaries ish, but. Again, they're completely different from other celebrations, so you know they're unique and different. That's why I like doing videos on them. So yeah, again, Vegeta's like that really amazing, really good. I don't really go over the type of grossing units when they come out, but maybe I'll probably start doing that. I did back in the day. I remember um, I, it hit me yesterday. I was like, wait a minute, I do the type of grossing people. I kind of go over them and stuff like that. But yeah, again, active skill and stuff like that. I've not seen the animations myself, but I still need to upload them to the channel. Um, again, I'll do that when I get some more time. I still want to do it today. Yeah, I don't know, because I'm kind of being lazy on it, because there's so many animations of part new partner super attacks. I'm like, Vegeta has a super attack revamped. Again, there's so much stuff, like, so many super attacks and stuff like that. Again, if you're off the internet for, like, what, three or four days for Delkin, you're going to miss something. It always happens for me. Like, even if, like, a week, it's going to be, like, 500 years later. Even a day, it's still going to be, like, something new is going to come out. For me, it was, like, November last year. Um, I missed out on a lot of videos, like, God Goku and stuff like that. Um, August this year. Um, again, it'll be like four or five days, so I only had like, what, three or four videos I had to do. It wasn't that much. I um, posted my video, I was going to do that already, but then the internet went out, like, like, literally last Friday morning, and I was like, ah, crap. But yeah, again, I'm um, pretty good for Vegeta and stuff like that. Of course, a really good unit and stuff like that. Um, of course, you see the type of ghosting banners right here. And for Goku and JP, the banners are exactly the same. They're exactly the same, just JP, Goku does not have this, this Supreme Kai yet. He does, um, he will come out with Ultimate Gohan, so... I'll say next celebration, Ultimate Gohan should be our main unit. Um, the one from Battlefield, the Battlefield Art. Again, those assets are, are in the game and stuff like that. They're already, but they're probably, are, they're probably are already ready, like, for stuff like that. Because we already know what Global they're going to do, like, discounts and stuff like that, you know. For, like, they have a Kefla, a Beerus. So, yeah, when Ultimate Gohan comes out, like I said before, I'm going to freaking get it. I'm going to freaking, freaking, freaking some of the discounts. You already know it. I do recommend people doing that as well. Because, again, you're basically something on that. I mean, it's only a Global thing right now, because, you know. Um, so I, you know, Goldblum and JP are separate and stuff like that. So yeah, um, again, hopefully, though, like, it go come, maybe come to JP one day or something like that. Um, I guess we could, like, share in a festivity, because I feel like both versions should at least get that, um, so they can be fair to each other and stuff like that. But, you know, how Bandai, you know, Global does their stuff, stuff like that, you know, with tickets and people are trouble and stuff like that. Hopefully, they'll hit end of hitting JP. They usually do that, like, a couple times later, besides, you know, potential orb event where you can get an extra potential orb unit on the map, um, for... JP, but they do it for global. So yeah, again, very exactly the same as stuff like that. I do go over this for every top grossing video, and of course, um, um, for the tickets right here, specifically for these tickets, they are specifically for this banner that I just clicked on. This banner, and again, for global and JP, exact same banner. Just global does not have triples and monsters. They had a certain cutoff point between I think um, January slash February. So yeah, again, a lot don't really make sense either. But they did it last year too, where they basically were not on the banner as well. So yeah, again, typical stuff like that, of course. But yeah, like I said though before, um. Again, the tickets are basically for this banner and stuff like that. Again, they're probably like, oh yeah, here's your memorial stone. Bye. Just really like, literally like that though, of course. But yeah, um, again, these are the banners right now for global right now. Um, I do like to go over um for whatever version I do because I think last time I went over for JP, um, for Vegeta's banner and for global, I'm gonna go for global's version. Again, both banners for global, they're insane though. Like they really put a lot of LRs on here. So if you have really had to make sense. I feel like Gogeta was going to be on here, I'm thinking, like, oh yeah, Vegeta's going to be on here as well. It makes sense as well, because they are Dark Professor LRs. But yeah, like I said, both banners are completely insane like they were last year. Last year was pretty okay, I already had, like, half the units already. But yeah, again, these banners for Global are really much insane and stuff like that. Of course, um, Lot of Vegeta and Goku, first time coming back for them. Cooler coming back, Bardock coming back, so I guess they're going to be pairs on banners now. Um, Bardock and Cooler. It makes sense because they did come out around the same time. For Global specifically, they're like a month apart, but... Now yeah, it happens. But yeah, of course, um, Gohan being on here is amazing as well. Again, JB Banner is exactly the same. It's just that, um, let me move this over. Um, Gohan JB Banner, they're exactly the same though. Just, um, JB has Boo and, of course, Go Tanks. Again, this, these guys are going to be in here for Global November. That's going to be November. That's always going to be that time. So I get for Tanda Bile slash Picky Celebration. We're going to get Prune Goishes. I'm going to go over those every single day for about a good two weeks and stuff like that. And Ultimate Gohan, the one from Battlefield and stuff like that. I did do a video for him and stuff like that. Maybe I'll put it in the eye up above, but that's why I keep all my other videos. So, you know, if you don't like Doki, you get a lot of like Sonic, Beyblade, Pokemon. Again, I, do, like, I love doing all the content on my channel as well. So, just keep the content fresh. That's why I like stuffing it all on my one channel. Sure, it might be behind like a month or two or whatever, but I'm still going to end up uploading the video anyway. I don't never let a video go to waste. Maybe one or two that don't are kind of really over, over outdated, but I don't care. But yeah, again, so I really want to go today. Again, though, I'd rather say for some of these banners. Probably not right now. 
right now because the discounts are gone, but for me, I'm going to sell them on the second to last day and stuff like that, of course, you know, so I can get the um, busy and out and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, realistically, though, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here, though. Like I said, it wasn't going to really make it that long. Again, Global JP Banners, both really good, both really amazing. Um, I probably don't, again, recommend something on it now because, you know, discounts are gone and stuff like that, so you don't have to waste your stones over 15 stones. This going to take a lot, though, because as you realize you're summoning and stuff like that, you're going to lose a lot of stones. A lot more because, you know, let's not buy three, get one free. Um, and no, they're not going to keep up the whole celebration. They've never done it before, so. Yeah, and of course, Global doesn't have tickets this time around because it is a joint celebration. So, unfortunately, though, Global's not going to have tickets. But, yeah, again, like I said, though, before, um, yeah, Global being on the banner for Global is going to be amazing as well because you can. I'd rather say get cooler than go to other Duck Fest LRs like Cell, um, so for Goku and Vegeta, because again, um, Gogeta and stuff like that, those are really more worth it though. Because other Duck Fest units, they're going to be back like on every Joe Duck Fest banner. Um, that's why, that's why I said something on these type of banners because you're getting more value out of these. Like all these units have really good value. Such as my Goku and Frieza, free Goku and Vegeta, because I guess they're a pair now. They're going to probably show up on every banner, um, every other Joe Duck Fest banner. Because they were, I mean, he was on the banner last year, so that makes sense. Then he was on the banner three different times. Last year, ticket banner, then anniversary banner. So, yeah. Um, it was him and Frieza. Now, I think, I don't know how Trevor and Frieza is going to be back on every banner now because, you know, he's got his counterpart and stuff like that and blah, blah, blah. But yeah, again, this is Golden Globals. Again, I would really say get cooler than pick one of the Joker Fest LRs. I kind of get it now because these guys, like all these guys, usually come back on easy banners or they're um, always this other side unit or whatever. If, if you, excuse me, if you really see someone on easy banners. But yeah, gonna go ahead and end the video here, though. Like I said, pretty good stuff right here. Um, for Goldman JP, again, go ahead and um, coins and stuff like that. Again, no tickets though, but um, um, the discounts and of course, you know, the coins will probably end up being enough anyway. So yeah, see you guys later though. Thank you so, for, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, great life, all good junk. Again though, go ahead and end it here. What do you guys think? Pretty good rewards, stuff like that. Again, good upload the video. As I'm done, you know, editing and stuff like that, of course, typical stuff. But yeah, see you guys later though. Again though, peace out.